We're busy people. But we need to talk... Methane! Yes, the gas. Yes, that gas. And its role in the biggest threat to public health, climate change. While carbon dioxide gets all the blame for packing heat, methane is a close rival. Though dwarfed by the amount of CO2, it's 80 times more powerful, behind 30% of our climate woes. Not only that, but the inhalation of methane's toxic co-pollutants and the ozone it helps produce keeps us even busier. While CO2 stays in the atmosphere for centuries, methane only lasts around a decade. But methane emissions are growing, double pre-industrial concentrations. Even if we stopped all CO2 production today, methane emissions would still mean we pass 1.5 degrees warming. And we think we're busy now. So where does this methane come from? Livestock, manure and bad land management create huge amounts of methane, as do landfill sites where our waste rots. And significantly, fossil fuel production releases massive methane emissions. So how do we get off our gases? Firstly, the easy fixes, like getting fossil fuel companies to stop leakage, then replacing coal, oil and gas with renewable energy, moving to low meat, plant-rich diets, and using food and agri-waste as compost as part of a circular economy. All this could reduce human-caused methane by up to 45% within the next decade and avert 0.3 degrees Celsius of temperature rise by 2045, giving the world a little more breathing space, better health, and a first easy win against climate change. Leaving us a little less busy.